Hi, I'm in Columbia, Maryland at the beautiful lakefront. Columbia, Maryland is one of the most renowned planned cities in the nation. And if you're thinking of moving here, watch this video and find out the pros and cons of living in Columbia, Maryland. My name is Amy Brown. I'm a realtor with the legal team of Long & Foster in Columbia, Maryland. And I'm gonna start with the pros. The first pro of Columbia, Maryland is the dining. There are so many wonderful options here and I'm just gonna tell you a few of my favorites. There's the Stanford Grill, there's Maggiano's Italian, and of course, my favorite, the number one restaurant in the world, the Cheesecake Factory, is by the Mall in Columbia. The second pro is commuting. You have two major job markets. It's about a 45 minute commute to DC and about a 35 minute commute to the Baltimore Inner Harbor. Housing. Columbia, Maryland is internationally renowned for being a thriving planned community. There are 10 villages in Columbia, each with a village center. James Rouse's vision was to have socioeconomic diversity and he absolutely achieved that. There are apartments, there are condos, townhomes and single family homes all within the villages of Columbia. And the average single family home price here is $362,000. There's wonderful shopping in Columbia. The mall at Columbia has over 200 stores to choose from. And for grocery stores, we have every type. We have Whole Foods, we have Wegmans, we have Trader Joe's, Harris Teeter, and my favorite, Costco. The Howard County Public School System is ranked very highly in the state of Maryland. And Howard Community College, located in Columbia, has more than 100 programs, including the nursing program that my daughter is enrolled in, Go Dragons! And there are many non-credit courses for the community members. There are a lot of entertainment options. We have the Meriwether Post Pavilion for concerts. We have Toby's Dinner Theater. And there is a Howard County Center for the Arts. And they have a lot of waterfront festivals in the summer. The Columbia Association fee gives you an option to buy a pool membership at a discount if you live in a CA property. They have golf courses, lakes, hiking and jogging trails, you name it. Now we're gonna talk about the cons because no place is perfect. So let's start that. The traffic. It gets very heavy here on Route 29, 32, and Route 175 during rush hour. So just be aware that the commute times I mentioned earlier can vary greatly if there's an accident. The Columbia Association offers many benefits but a negative would be if you want to show your creative side and you want to paint your front door bright purple, you would need permission from the Columbia Association to make those architectural changes. And you would probably not get approval would be my guess. And if you're a person that goes directly to work and directly home and you don't use any of the CA amenities, you might feel like you're paying for that and yet you're not using it. And lastly, the parking at the mall in Columbia. The mall is busy, crazy busy, seven days a week. And during the holidays, it's about impossible to find a parking spot unless you come when the mall first opens. If you have questions about living in Columbia, please send me a text or give me a call. I'd be happy to answer your questions. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I really appreciate when you subscribe. It makes me feel like I have more friends than I actually do. Thank you for watching.